Shout out one, Israel. Shout out one. All praise and honor and glory goes to Yahweh, while Yahweh Shah, the Wadi Yahweh Shemel Shah, for giving us the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, who deserve double honors, rightfully so. Shout out one to Yahakim, pushing the word in sincerity and in truth and being faith based. Shout out one. Okay, um, got a couple of verses. You know, the Lord willing to be edified to the whole full elect. And keep you on, keep you on, keep you walking on those eggshells, right? And because um, through the spirit of Yahweh, the um, the whole full elect is scarcely gonna be saved, right? But those that rebel are gonna be destroyed right here. So this is this is to build, this to keep you the whole full elect on their toes, right? Keep pushing the word and doing your work and staying diligent to the best of your ability, right? Because um. The, the, the rebellions are going to be destroyed, and that rebellions is um is is the Habba Shimei Alshad's kids. They're very rebellion. Right? They found the ways of all the other nations, and the Lord is going to destroy them. Um, just last night, you know, I made a point to someone, you know, at the plantation, you know, and he didn't even know that. You know that Habba Shimei Alshad is jealous. There. These people think the Lord is loving. That's the only fun he, he has is to be loving. That's not true. Okay? The Lord is jealous. Alright? Um, let me get that scripture because I was reading that last night and it was spiritual. And he was all surprised that, you know, I went through my my um my phone and I had the Bible on there, like, you know, most of people look at me like I come some type of Muslim or some shit. That's bullshit, you know what I mean? But um, to the spirit of Hashem, I'm gonna keep this edifying. All right. It says um, uh, this is Ecclesi. I mean, sorry, Exodus chapter twenty verse. Uh, I start at Exodus chapter twenty verse. Hey, I'll read up. I'll read up to five just to get the point. All right. It says Exodus chapter twenty verse one, and God spake all the words, all these words, saying, "I am the Lord thy power, which have brought thee out of the land of Egypt, and that was we was under captivity of the Africans, the so-called Africans, all right, which were the Hamites, Mizraim, all right, all right, all right. That's the real name, Mizraim, okay." I am the Lord thy power, which brought thee out, thee out of the land of Egypt, out of the house of bondage. Okay? Because we we're bondage, we slavery. And we are in bondage right now, and the Lord's going to do it again. Because the new, the modern day Egypt is, um, is, um, is America. Okay? And thou shalt have no other God before thee. And that's what you niggas in Spix and Native America has been doing out here. Okay? You've been caught up in all these other philosophies. Those are gods, idols, right? Um, um, Buddha, Buddhism, being a Muslim, being a five sinner, okay? But the Lord, the Lord doesn't want you to pull you out of there, okay? All right. Thou should have no other gods before me. Thou should not make unto thee any graven image or any likeness of any of anything that's in the heavens above or that is in the earth beneath or that is in the waters under or that is in the waters under the earth okay because there's a lot of damn <laughs> that that proved that that even back then um man son of man was caught up in the mix of seeing other uh we're gonna say mythical creatures or even seeing flying objects and start praying to it instead of understanding what what's going on, you know, or lost losing the um the the mindset of what Yahweh Shimon Shah gave to his hopeful elect, like, even to his nation, and that goes back to the wilderness <clears throat> because it was all that glory that was shown to us. It's, it got booted out of their head through generations. Okay. Um, this is um, verse five. Uh, that thou, that thou, I mean, that shall not bow down. Thou should not bow down thyself 
to them. All right, you should not worship anything but your Abba Shem Yom Shah. Okay, this thing is done in DCC in order. All right, all right, but you gotta understand that there's that order is set up to to um to to make you obedient and to discipline you. Okay, I right, thou should not bow down thyself to them, nor serve them. For I am the Lord thy power, am a jealous power. You see? So, you know, that starts with Yahweh and then Yahweh Shah. So, just as Yahweh is, so is Yahweh Shah. Okay? They jealous. They want, they want, they want, the, they want everything to themselves. Alright? And rightfully so. Because they made everything. Visiting the iniquities of the fathers upon the children. Okay? That goes, the fathers brought the children, and then the children, children is going to bring the fathers. Okay? And then they're going to, they, that's, when the, that's when that judgment is going to come upon the fathers. All right? All right? Um, visiting the iniquities of the fathers upon the children upon the third and fourth generation. Of them that hate me. And you know, you niggas and spits, you hate, you niggas and spits, you hate Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah. And that proved in, with the next scripture I'm about to bring out. Because I was going, I was watching um, the brother, you know, Shaba, Shaba, um, Shaba, I mean, uh, Yashawamba, which is um, Sh um, Shah Maaf Ba. And he got it from Yahweh Shah is coming back. He put up, they put up this good video, and I mean, the guy from Yahweh Hashem Yahweh coming in from Mississippi, he, you know, he was he broke it down beautiful, and he went into um, how you say uh, let me see here, he went into the scripture and uh, well he went into um, he went into let me see here, come back to that, uh, he went into Ephesians chapter four verse eight. But I found another scripture that 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 um that 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 put it to the to the forefront, you know, of what you motherfuckers has been doing. That even goes for you, damn um, two thirds, you know, because we know what Esau is. We know what they attempted to do. They trying to destroy us. But you niggas and spirits and Native Americans, you only destroying what's yours. That's how fucking you yeah, like devilish, man, you know. <laughs> Destroying your own shit, you know, you're, you're destructive. I right, see so you're rebellion. Cause that brought me to it. The, the point was, but you have to have rebellion, you are. All right, so, all right, so we're gonna get on to that scripture. All right, and it says, um, cause he read. Right, let's read the scripture he read. All right, which was beautiful. I mean, I, I can't even finish watching the video. That's how deep it went. And I actually I was sleeping because I put things on, it, and I just let it all automatically play. And, and, you know, and, man, he, when I heard that, woke me up. I said, what the hell? I just heard. I said, because, you know, you go into scriptures, you know, you still, you still learn it. You know what I mean? And, and, and if you hear something, you know what I said. You wake up, oh, man, did I just hear that? So, you know, I was sleeping when I heard the scripture. And, you know, and, and it was beautiful. I, you know, I probably read it. But, you know, when he broke it down, he broke it down. It was beautiful. Okay. And it says, um. Ephesians chapter 4 verse 8 Wherefore he has Wherefore he said When he ascended up on high That's too much how shot Alright He made captivity captive <laughs> Oh you know, That's that part right there I said, Oh man Yo I gotta get up <laughs> That was like a That was like a Like a, like a charge Oh me up Time to get it on. And I was like, oh man. He led captivities into captive. That's like that's the goes with I think in Revelation it said um, he um he destroyed death. Okay? He destroyed death. And he destroyed captivity upon us as a nation. Because we was not supposed to taste of that cup. And that cup the word hell represents a condition. Alright? 
of hell, of, of slavery. And that cup, that cup is that condition. You're going to drink that down the rest of the nations. Right? Wherefore he said, when he has ascended up on high, he led captivity captive. Look, wherefore he said, when he ascended up on high, he laid captivity captive and gave a gift unto men. So how do you how do you break that? You know what I'm saying? That gift, that gift is the scriptures. If you don't if you don't understand the scriptures, the Lord is not done with you. Alright? And there's a spiritual gift. Alright? That gift is it's like it's, it's internal. It's like it's life. You know, and when you get it and when you hear it, you be like, what the? and it wakes you up. It hits that charge. Like, you know, sometimes I hear the apostle say, you know, you know, the spirit deals with you. You hear the spirit, the spirit deals with you. And then you and you that's when you know you hear a certain word. Oh, and you, I've been in certain situations when I see certain individuals and I'm like, oh, that's that, that's a key from the Lord. Alright? So it said I mean the brother brought it out, he broke it down beautifully. I mean, you know, uh, let me just go back. All right, because that gift is the scriptures, all right, and everything else that comes with it. All right, so um, let's go back into that one because I was, you know, all right, let's go back to it. Uh, and it says, this is, this is Psalms chapter 68, verse 18. Thou has ascended on high. That's your high was shot. Because David is saying this about, you know, he's saying he's, so, he, the David is a prophet. Right, the word prophet doesn't mean to say before. Thou has ascended on high. Thou has laid captivity captive. How do you lay that captivity captive? How do you lock them something? This cause that means we're gonna live, we're gonna have eternal power, man. We ain't gonna never go back into the situation we in. Right? He has said on he has ascended on high. Thou has laid captive, captivity captive. Thou has received a gift for men. He, that means them galaxies that's out there, the, the planets, those are gifts. Go a little deeper. Those gifts out there could they, fucking Esau. When I went into the, deeper into the video, fucking Esau trying to get everywhere. Because they, they mad. They, 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 ain't, they ain't getting it. But what we going to get? They're not going to get what we get. That gift that the Lord's going to have, them gifts, all those gifts that the Yahweh is going to give us, they ain't going to get it. Thou has ascended on high, thou has laid captivity captive, and thou has received a gift for men. Yahweh <laughs> has received a gift for us. He got a gift. It says, um, and, um, he said, I laid up many mansions. So he knew that in the flesh, he said that in the flesh, and he done that in the spirit. And, I mean, I mean, in the, in the spiritual, the, 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 uh, the, uh, the, um, the spiritual body. He's out there right now, building up galaxies and planets. Cause we're gonna have to. We're gonna be. We're we're the sand of the sea. Can you count the sand of the sea? All right, but you Negroes and Hispanics and Native Americans, y'all did. You know, y'all 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 um y'all try to mock the Lord, but the Lord gonna mock you. All right. All right. And um, it says, "Thou hast ascended on high, and thou has laid captivity captive." Thou have received a gift for men, yea, for the rebellions. This is what I'm getting to. I'm getting to you, Negroes and Hispanics and Native Americans, man. You the one that helped the Romans. All right, starting with the, the um the uh, let me see right here uh, the southern the southern kingdom, Judah, Benjamin, and Levi, because the um the, the northern kingdom was already here in America, okay, from 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 um. From Simeon, Zebulon, Ephraim, Manasseh, Gad, Reuben, Natali, Asher, and Ishakar, y'all was already here in the soil of America, all right? So we're not, you know, y'all not excluded though, but, you know, we're talking about those that